In this video, we will see how to connect 11 labs to another make module so that you can generate speech from text and use 11 labs voices. To do this, you will need make account. You can create a free account with make. You will get two free active scenarios and thousand free operations. Here is the pricing plans page. You see this is a free account. They also have different tiers of subscriptions. Make.com is a powerful no code automation tool. Then 11 labs account. You can create a free account that includes 10,000 characters of text and 10 minutes of audio per month. Here is the pricing plans page. They have different tiers of subscriptions. The starter plan is not that expensive. It is just $5 per month. If you'd like to purchase, you can clone your own voice with the starter plan. 11 Labs is one of the best AI voice generation tool. It provides exceptional voice cloning capabilities and high quality output. You will need Google Drive to store the generated audio file. I made a separate video with the title Make Automation How to Connect Google Drive to Make. You can refer to the link in the video description. I also provided the links to tools websites in the video description. To connect 11 labs to Make, you must first obtain an API key from your 11 labs account. Log into your 11 labs account. Here you can see I am logged into my account. Scroll down, click on your profile icon on bottom left side here and then click on profile plus API key. Next to the API key, you click this I icon to view and copy your API key and store it in a safe place. Log into your make account and add 11 labs module to your scenario. Here I have added the 11 labs module. You will see create a connection option here. Click on that create a connection option. Then you will see this dialog box pop up. You can give any name here for the connection name. In the API key field, paste the API key from 11 labs. Then click this save button here. Once you connect successfully, you will see this dialog box. In the voice field here, we can select the voice of our choice by clicking this drop down box. There are a lot of pre-made voices available here. You can also clone your own voice and you can select that from here. Here we are selecting the pre-made voice of Sarah. In the model field, we have these different options. Select 11 multilingual V2. In the text field, you can type in the text that you want to generate audio. I pasted this text here. There are few more advanced settings here like stability, similarity, boost. You can leave them blank and then click on this OK button here. Next, we want to store the generated audio file in the Google Drive, which we can use later on. Add the Google Drive upload file module here. If you are using Google Drive module for the first time, you will see create a connection option here. Once you click on that, you will see this dialog box pop up. Give any name to the connection here and then click on this sign in with Google button. Follow all prompts so that make can connect to your Google Drive. Once you establish successful connection, you will see this dialog box. In the enter a folder ID field, click on this drop down box and select this select from list option. In the new drive location, click this drop down box and select my drive. Click in this new folder location field and let it refresh. Then select the directory where you want to store the audio file. I am selecting this directory name. Select this 11 labs create a speech synthesis radio button in the file field. Then click on this OK button. Then click on this save button to save your entire scenario. Now our scenario is ready for testing. You can click this run once button to execute the scenario and see if it runs successfully. I am clicking this run once button. You can see the scenario is running. You can see here the scenario ran successfully. Green letters below the module mean the module ran successfully. We can also examine input and output of each module by clicking this magnifying glass. If I want to see the output from the Google Drive module, I can click on this. Here is the input and here is the output. There are various details here. We can also see the file name that got generated here. Now let us check our Google Drive and verify the audio file got generated. This is my Google Drive and this is the directory. You can see the audio file got generated here. Let us check it out by playing. 
This voice is generated by 11 Labs inside Make.com. It will be converted into speech using 11 Labs pre-made Voice of Sarah. You can see everything worked as expected. Congratulations, you have successfully established the connection and generated the audio file. You can now edit your scenario and add more 11 Labs modules. Bye until next video.